Hello, my name is Brian Cumming. I'm Bruce Power's Fire Chief. Bruce Power is located in Ontario, Canada, and Bruce Power is now the largest nuclear generating facility in the world. Several months ago, there was an event that occurred in Fukushima, Japan, that impacted on all nuclear industry, and uh, specifically uh, with ourselves. We uh, ended up having to come up with a with a goal of achieving not only providing fire protection for our plants, but also emergency cooling for our reactors and fuel bays. We are really leading the industry on the concept of taking fire apparatus, something that individuals own. There's ownership. There's uh, awareness of how the equipment works. People are using it on each and every day. So the familiarization on how to utilize that equipment during an emergency is a natural fit. And so uh, to deploy this equipment during uh, an unusual circumstance that impacts on our station's capabilities to provide self-cooling for the reactors is something that's going to be natural for our staff to, to operate under uh, extreme conditions with. And so the familiarity with the apparatus, the fact that we're using fire trucks versus pumps on uh, skids or pumps on trailers is really a natural fit for us, and we believe that it's one, uh, one that's going to set us up for success in the event that they're ever needed. I entered into discussions with a company called Dependable Emergency Vehicles. Dependable worked in partnership with, at that time, Crimson Fire, which is now Spartan ERV. And over the span of the next several weeks, we came together with a design concept for a fire truck that would actually be uh, able to provide emergency cooling to our reactor cores and still be utilized on a day-to-day -day basis for firefighting activities. The fire trucks uh, we designed for the company had to meet specific demands that were set out by our plant engineers, and that was to provide uh, cooling capabilities, which, which really uh, required us to build trucks with 3,000 U.S. GPM pumps and to be able to draft water from a static source a level of 20 feet, and still maintain a performance level of at least 1,500 U.S. GPM uh, per apparatus. The concept through to construction and build is something that involves several agencies, that not only of dependable, Spartan ERV, hail pump manufacturing, but also our plant engineers because we needed to be able to satisfy the, the needs of our plant primarily. And so the task was challenging. The relationship and the interaction amongst all agencies was extremely well organized. Everyone had a common goal to satisfy the needs of Bruce Power. In the event that you uh, are tasked with such a, a situation, whether municipal or whether it's industrial, to know exactly what your needs are and then to approach a firm that you believe is reputable because you're really laying your company's business on the line and uh, and Bruce Power is uh, is really looking at a quality manufacturer supplier and a and a piece of equipment to be able to deliver. So you need to know what it is that you must have, and then you need to be able to work with reputable individuals and companies to be able to deliver on that. And the relationship that uh, we have discovered, which unfolded completely out of necessity, was that we have found that we are very pleased with the services provided by Dependable, Spartan ERV, Hale Engineering, to be able to build us an apparatus that is what we're classifying as being top-notch.